Hey everybody, uh, Brian here from quantlabs.net. I uh, just wanted to show you the first of uh, one of two programs or applications or software components, whatever you want to call them, uh, that I'll be using as part of my core uh, live trading system. Uh, as you know, I've got three pieces when it comes to the Simulink uh, models that I'll be generating. Uh, there's the inflow, the outflow, and then the model itself for uh, Simulink, which is part of MATLAB. So let me um, get to that. Uh, the first one that I'm going to show you is the inflow. It's uh, from a piece of uh, manufacturer called uh, QMatix, XLQ is the software. Here's the uh, download link. Uh, actually, there's two parts to this um, piece of software. Uh, there's what's something called the XLQ Companion. And then there's a spreadsheet which is um, uh, part of uh, the package that you download as, as part of the trial. It's a very affordable uh, piece of software. It's, it's very sophisticated, believe me. Uh, it's, it's quite good. So let me give you a rundown of how it all works. Um, essentially, this is the sample uh, spreadsheet. Um, actually, no, let me start off with the, because there's so much here. Um, under the Q collector, there is um, your preferences, which I'll load up. Um, essentially, what you're, uh, one of the powerful things is that you can use uh, a number of sources of, of data, be it from MSN, IQ Feed, Google. Uh, in my case, obviously, I'm using IQ Feed uh, for people that are uh, into the free stuff. Uh, uh, MSN, uh, Yahoo, and Google will work on some other, and including TD Ameritrade. So. I'm just showing you uh, this under the preferences, um, as well as um, this is a sample spreadsheet you get with the package. Um, you get over God, like like a couple of hundred functions to work from, as where it has a complete API where you can do things like it's all mostly technical, uh, you know, market cap, price per share, uh, per earnings, uh, change percentage bid ask all these functions that you can get and here they are under your uh, Excel um, now the other thing is I'll show you in a bit you can actually use uh, there is an API for this so as long as you're using a programming language that can connect using uh, Microsoft com uh, obviously in my case I'll show you some samples for C sharp and uh, C++ namely I'm going after the C++ obviously uh, that's where everything I'm going to be working with resides within the C++ so let me just show you what this thing can do. It's very powerful. Um, so you have your historical, uh, all all this stuff for I don't know these these examples here, Google, Microsoft. I think the market's closed, so you won't see the movement. This is, this can be done in real time, and it does connect into yeah uh, into my IQ feed. Uh, so here uh, I'm connecting into Coca-Cola uh, using IQ feed as a source. Uh, it brings back all this information all in real time. Um, you get a, a market overview on your different uh, categories and sectors within uh, your major in, uh, major exchanges. Uh, you get um, this is just out of the box when you download it. Uh, you get your portfolio, so you can add in your own portfolio uh, stuff here. Um, it, it's very powerful. Uh, you get intraday if you want. Obviously, I'll be focusing on that for different um, for different uh, um, stocks and ticks and whatnot. So you can hear I've got a few ticks for Microsoft, a few ticks for INTC, um, and then currency. Now, this is what I'm also interested in as well. This this, this data is coming in from Yahoo, but you can track that. Um, and again, you can also track it within the uh, stock price. And you can also have the capability of generating your own graphs as well, based upon ticks. Just unbelievable what you get with this for, for, for let me just show you the price. <laughs> uh, $149. I mean, that, that's the XLQ, XLQ Plus. Um, and uh, you get all access to all these, to all these functions within uh, Excel and probably the COM as well. Uh, and then let me continue with the spreadsheet, with this worksheet. Our spreadsheet. Um, so we got the drawdown, da 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 da, stock chart capabilities. This can again be done all in real time. So you get some uh, very powerful um, uh, different types of charting that you can do. All again, all in real time. Uh, calculations for whatever you want. All your traditional EMA, MAC, 
MACD, so on and so forth, but you, you can expand it even further and, and you get some very, very powerful, um, uh, a lot, a lot, a lot of functionality. Um, some of the functions you get with this thing, um, I'm not sure where it is, but uh, uh, on the site, yeah, here, here's all the different uh, functions you get with, with the XLQ. Plus, or I'm gonna, I'm definitely going for the plus. It's it's very affordable. But you you get all these different functions: director, you know, MACD, average gain, commodity. I mean, it's just unbelievable what you get. So that's all my input. Now, remember what I showed you in another video um, here with the MATLAB. This is the powerful thing with MATLAB using the um, this toolbox right here. Uh, and I've shown a video of this. Um, you're using the um, what do you call it? The uh, spreadsheet link ex uh, toolbox. So what you could do is you can essentially um, have a MATLAB model uh, watch any of these uh, worksheets, any of these. Um, uh, uh, I, I'm not an Excel guy, but if there's a change, let's say here and you tell MATLAB to watch it and listen to it um, in real time it can react based upon that change so that's a really really powerful combination right there um, this 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 software this XLQ can be used with um, with uh, uh, a com as well I'll show you that in a second now this is the spreadsheet part okay this is the powerful so you, you can see why I'm very interested now using Excel as, as my front end, being able to uh, do all my charting, all my functionality when it comes to to uh, to to these worksheets. It, it's just it's just an, an incredible piece of software engineering. Um, so let me take you into the 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 compo uh, the um, what we call the Excel Q uh, companion. So what I've done is you you you, you can add uh, in a symbol. Uh, it gets kind of confusing. But once you, you understand it, uh, it, it's not too bad. Uh, so let me go back into my tray here. Uh, I, I'm going to add in my symbol, which will load up this uh, day list. So in my case, you, you, you can separate what you're watching um, by your source. So in my case, let's say if I have Yahoo, you can watch all this stuff. Uh, where's my Yahoo? Okay. Uh, obviously, I want to leverage off of IQ feed. Reason being is that I can watch the Euro, US dollar, FXCM because hey, um, I'm able to uh, I'm subscribed to uh, uh, IQ feed, uh, which is my source here, um, and then I can watch it um, and and then again develop some kind of spreadsheet uh, to, to to do the same thing here um, and. Uh, uh, react or trigger or whatever, um, but it's it's very very powerful. Uh, I play with some of the screeners out there; they're very powerful what they can do. Um, but uh, this is probably going to be a lot easier because uh, you know obviously I'll be working with uh, VBA. I'm not a VBA guy, but it's a lot easier to work with than other languages like uh, some I've seen in Java and some other programming languages. So, um, if, and, and Excel is very powerful. So I I could see myself leveraging my my the use of of of, of uh, leveraging the use of Excel okay so let's get back to the really um, powerful part of XLQ now within XLQ if you come under the XLQ uh, companion the help you'll get uh, two options here which I'm interested but these are the other examples that you can work with uh, in other languages like Perl, C Sharp, C++, uh, VB, Word my case, let's say if I want to work with, uh, my case, obviously, C++. Okay, So here's the C++. Here's the example source code. Now, I haven't confirmed to have this working, but I, I see no reason why this would not work. The only complicated part is, is uh, setting up your code to initialize the column. So uh, that's one part. Uh, and also, there's uh, a more a better example uh, in uh, C Sharp. Here it is, um, and uh, overall, this can be done. I don't see why it cannot be done. Um, and as far as I can tell, the support's really good. If I go back to the uh, vendor, um, the reviews or comments, uh, a lot of people saying very good things. 
fantastic, amazing, really strong. All you know, it's 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 it's, it's an amazing uh, piece of piece piece of engineering. Um, let me just see. Uh, it's really it looks like a one person show by the name of Leo, um, and uh, he's he's doing this full time. Um, I don't know, but but he seems to be he's got a good little product going. And uh, I just wanted to introduce that to you guys uh, as, as this will be my inflow of various data uh, for um, Yahoo. Uh, well, obviously, IQ feeds my primary uh, focus. So I just want to introduce that to you. Um, and I'm sure your jaw is still dropped. And it'll probably take you half an hour to pick it up because, um, you know, these sort of things are very powerful. Uh, when you think about it because um, you're leveraging the power off of things like again MATLAB you can integrate with it and, and especially Excel very exciting uh, very exciting uh, opportunities here alright talk to you later